We have an array of products to assist you in all your beauty or body needs. Do you want curly, soft, beautiful hair? Well, try our relaxer line, designed to leave your hair soft, silky, and full of body. Or would you like beautiful, straight, shiny, long-lasting hair? Well, try our cherry or extreme hold spritz with our cream shine. It's guaranteed to give you that look you want. How about dry, achy feet or legs that you can't seem to keep moisturized? Well, try our African Shea Butter Foot Lotion. We have many products to help you with all phases of your beauty and body needs. For a full list of all our products, please visit our website at www.aeasysilk.com or call us at 313-277-2319. Has age finally caught up with you? Do you have high blood pressure, diabetes, or kidney disease? Well, look and feel younger today. We discovered a new product that promotes appearance and joint issues by the way of collagen, HA, and other super ingredients without injections. This product will significantly improve joint mobility, help with high blood pressure, kidney disease, and diabetes. It'll also help your skin as well. Call us now at 706-319-0255 or 313-885-4321. Father in heaven, Father in heaven. Shine, your light. shine your light Through the darkness, Through the darkness. I want to walk right. I, want to walk right. I don't want to stumble I don't want to stumble I want to live in love Without peace within Say it again Father in heaven Come on y'all Shine your light Good morning, good morning, good morning once again. Thank you for tuning in right here to the HPR TV 33 and Comcast on your dial. We are live in Living Color this morning with another edition. Let's talk care with your shooter, the hair doctor. We're live in Living Color right here. Uh, uh, we'll call a friend and tell a friend to tune in. Uh, you see the numbers down at the bottom of the screen. You get ready to call in because we want to have a good topic today. You know, I think I, I want to change it a little bit. I was talking about last week, I'm going to put the women's out front. I'm going to keep the women's out front. Uh, why am I going to do that? Because sometimes us men, we fall by the wayside. And some people think women just begun to be in front. But in the, even in the field of cosmetologists, uh, we have the woman up front. I'm talking about none other than Madam C.J. Walker. She showed us the way, and we're still carrying on the, even today. We are carrying on, and more women that begin to step up to the plate and become alive and, 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 and do the right thing. Somehow, we have fell by the wayside, including all men, not all men, but some men. But this morning, we're going to put that out there. If you know any woman that's doing a great thing, and uh, before I get started too good, like the, you heard the passing of our, one of our greatest, greatest uh, number one uh, uh, singer, uh, that's uh, Sister Rika Franklin, I salute her this morning for all the things that she brought to the forefront. She went all the way out front. We don't know her life. We can, uh, where she been, the road she been down or went down, we don't know. We can imagine, and matter of fact, we can even talk about it. We can put things in place, maybe happen or may not happen. But and still, when she left here, she's an icon. We salute that. We don't go back to try to find bad things. We salute the great things. So all women this morning, I salute you. First of all, start with Mary. Had it been for Mary, we wouldn't be where we are today. All right? So we're going to move forward. No 
uh, Mel Chauvin's this morning. We're talking about the great things that women have done and up until including today. My mom was a strong woman. She brought me through. As I look back at the, uh, uh, the scripture that David said, she would help me to make it through the valley of the shadow of death, and I didn't fear no evil. That's my mother. Men of mothers are like that. She tried to teach you the right thing. I'm talking about a real mother now. I ain't talking about one of those who just had a child. There are many of those out there. So if we're going to continue to move forward this morning, I thank God for you and you. And I salute all. And I salute my friend, Brother J.D. Hill, the founder of African Easy Silk Hair Care Product. As we begin to go in forward this morning, I'm going to tell you now, if you haven't had your coffee, if you haven't had your tea, get ready to have a sip for you and have one for me as I do the same for you this morning. Okay? I, I have a poster with me. I don't know if my uh, engineer can switch over to it this morning. I want to talk about that after I have my sip of tea for you and for me. Mm. That one for me. And that one for you. Mm. And that one for everybody else, too. And we come forward this morning. Uh, talking about the African Easy Silk Hair Care product line, I do have it here. Uh, I don't have the product in front of me today, but I do have a poster. Uh, I don't know if, uh, again, if uh, I see, if, uh, I'm trying to get it adjusted in your ear. I don't know if you can put it around or flip the camera or something so we can make it work happen so I can talk about this uh, this product this morning. And we're going to, if we need to take a break to do that, we'll do it. Uh, put the song back on. We see can make some kind of adjustment. I don't know how to, you what you want me to do with it so it can be seen. Because I need to talk about it. I got quite a bit to do with it this morning. But uh, as we continue to move forward, y'all work with me this morning, all right? I'm expecting a phone call a little later on this morning because I, one of my uh, uh, clients and customers of, of African Easy Silk Hair Care Product uh, found a new way to use the product, and they spoke to call in this morning and, and prepare ladies, uh, call your friends up because there's a lady talking about some great things. She called me and told me what she had found, uh, and she wanted to talk about it today, so we're going to talk about that later on in the show. And so women call a friend and tell a friend or tune in here at WHPR TV 33. And we will begin to talk about that. And when uh, uh, she called in, said she's going to call in this morning and she want to spread some good no news through some research she had found and, and everything, okay, uh, regarding the hair care products. And some of it have been around for a long time. But we do have the uh, uh, three new items will be coming in pretty soon. And that is the... Uh, coconut hair and scalp uh, conditioner and we have the very light vitamin E hair and scalp conditioner uh, which will be coming in soon and also the very light uh, olive oil hair and scalp conditioner. These are hair oils just like the uh, hair grease should I say just like the fertilized hair growth treatment. Uh, there's a new version of that be coming in pretty soon too and I want to tell you more about that as we go along okay and remember the hot number to call for well, all the distributors, I don't have that uh, list with me this morning. I had so many things were going on, I forgot the list, but the number, the hot number to call is Erico 313 2332319. Once again, Erico 313 2772319. And now uh, uh, that's the number you can see right at the top up there. Uh, as we making a uh, thing. Thank you, engineer. You, you, you're right on time. I'm going to have to make sure you get a big jar of that beauty cream so you can talk about it. But, uh, you know, you know what happens when you use it. But um, uh, it's moving real fast. But I want to tell you now, the, 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 hair, the very light hair, olive oil over there, olive oil, hair and scalp, that's just like the fertilized hair growth treatment, but it's a different version of it, okay? It's still a, a, a light hair oil or hair grease that you will be oiling your scalp with two to three times a week and the newest version is the vitamin e and the coconut oil so all that will be coming in those are solids not liquids now all three of these here are solid all right and then uh we're going to uh, uh when as soon as they come in i will have it here on the show with me as soon as they get in the last three at the bottom down there you will see them uh, over to, to the very first one there that's the olive oil hair and scalp 
and then in the center is a vitamin E, and over here close to me is the coconut oil, hair and scalp. All those are conditioners, hair grease, all right? And again, there's a light version for some people have very light hair, and they, and they, don't, they don't want anything real light, so uh, these are things was already in the vault waiting for it to be produced. So one of uh, people began to ask about it, so I called it a chemist and asked him what about it. He said, yeah, we can do it. And he sent me the flyer, so uh, I was with the flyer so we could start introducing it. And, and uh, so he, when you come in, I have it here for you. Just let you know. Now, most of you know about the, uh, I'm, uh, they, stay, they stay right there. I'm going to switch over. I'm going to switch the camera. Or I'm going to switch over to uh, the different one that I want to show you today, too. Uh, if you will. Now you know about the what, the Fertile Wild Hair Growth Treatment Oil. They came out with a solid also the Wild Growth Hair Food. That's the, everything you need to continue growing your hair and have healthy, beautiful hair. As we see, we have the always had the very light uh, olive oil and that's somebody put a call in and talk about that. We have the hair and scalp vitamin E uh, also and we have the uh, 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 the coconut oil. So these are the items that we just want to introduce to you and keep you abreast. Although you don't see the container, but it is here. It is very here. As you uh, stay right there, I'm gonna put the sign back over again, uh, so that you can see the uh, the up here at the top. Error to order your product to get your distributor nearest you is error code. 313-277-2319. I want to say good morning to a few other D, uh, distributors. Uh, before I go there, one of my distributors uh, uh, in the Flint area just called me and want to place a big order for me to ship out to them up in Flint. So Flint, if you tune in, uh, I'm, I'm going to have that number for you pretty soon too so you can call in and, and that person up there in Flint, my distributor up in Flint, uh, will tell you more about that. We'll continue to moving forward again. Start out with and show you how everything began to trickle down and come back around. That sounds pretty good. Trickle down and come back around. Madam C.J. Walker started something uh, many years ago. If the time was rough in my understanding, they're doing the research. And she didn't have a job. She said, "I'm gonna make me one." Now I didn't say she was the first one with a hair care product. But she's the first one that brought it out to the forefront. Took it out of the closet and bring it out on Front Street. I understand that uh, during that time, uh, using the phrase mama and them, grandma and them, do whatever they had to do to have something for their hair, right? To help promote hair growth. And they did. So Madam C.J. Walker went and found it and brought it out to the forefront. Not only did she make a mint off of it, but many others uh, took the same floor mat and, and took it out to the marketplace and been made mints. Matter of fact, uh, after I doing my study of working with other companies, I didn't say working for, I said working with other companies to sell representatives, just like the independent distributors we have for African Indian Silk and, and the sales managers and, uh, and the, um, and the promoters who are going out doing the shows and stuff. I got to know all of them during that time. They got new ones out there now that I don't know, but they had plenty out there because I was traveling from from Michigan to uh, Ohio, Ohio to Atlanta, Georgia, uh, all the way down to Memphis, Tennessee, and Mississippi, Arkansas, everywhere out there, Philadelphia, wherever I could go to learn more and more about the product when they were having hair shows and stuff and, and learn the knowledge and understanding what to do and what not to do. That's what I was doing to help promote. You, you have to have some background on understanding of whatever you're going to do in order to be better at it. Now, many uh, in whatever field you're in have to learn from the basement to the ceiling. If you start at the top, you'll lose something all the way down to the bottom. Well, I was at the bottom, and I went to the top too quick, so I had to go find out what was going on in the middle. So as I travel to the different ones and got to know some of the, uh, the top hairstylists and, and the top salesperson, uh, and, and they began to teach me things that I needed to know that I had missed along the way. That's what I brought to Brother J.D. Hill. And one of the things, well, 
how did this woman, uh, Madam C.J. Walker, was successful in what she was doing. She had to start somewhere. Well, long with, well, after Madam C.J. Walker, a young man came in. Many of you might remember Fisher Mills. Full of wave. Mr. Full of wave started his line of waves and wave brushes and wave caps. I don't know if he made it to fool the way that uh, Madam C.J. Walker did, but then many others come along. Like my friend of mine, Mr. Willie Morrow, with the California Curl. He was one of the first black chemists that got out there and did some things. One, I didn't say he was the number one, but he was number one with the curls. Because he brought out the California Curl. I got to know him. Mr. Green of Sawsheen, I got to know him. I got to know many of Mr. Brown right here in the city of Detroit, I got to know him. I found your Smith on New Day Products, I got to know him and work with him with some things. Mr. Brown with May Rain product, I got to know him. See, all of these individuals I'm talking about helped me to where I am today. Could I be like them? No. Back in the train up just a little bit, Brother J.D. Hill taught me a lot. What did he teach you? He said, whatever you're going to do, don't be a copycat. Learn from somebody else. Put it in your lane and formulate it for you and it'll work. It, it took a time for, it took a t long time for me to quite understand, get to understanding what he was, was talking about to I backtrack to my mom. My mom taught me how to cook. But I couldn't cook like her. But she told me to take what you can learn and keep on practicing. Don't give up and be your best. She said, but put God first and keep doing it. Keep trying. You're going to make mistakes, but correct them. Try to remember a mistake you made so you don't make the same mistake. This is what J.D. was teaching, but then a lot of times we forget where we come from and we want to be like somebody else. Like this day and time, back in the day you used common sense. Now it's called comma without the sense. They find another word that sounds good but mean the same thing, but in a different way. Bring it home. Formulate it for you. And then you will be better. Some of you out there know what I'm talking about. You, you, want, to, you want to be a Rick with Franklin, but you haven't been down her road. You want to be a J.D. Hill, but you, haven't, you didn't go down his road. But you can take what you learn from either one or even backing up the train to anybody you know that you want to be similar to them. But you have to go down that road of your own and figure out what you do to be good for you. A television, a TV, a radio host, you have to learn to be you. Some want to be the best preacher there is. They, they copy the other one. But when you copy, you just a copy. But if you take the copy and put it in your lane and formulate it for you and be good at you, then you'll be original. But ain't nothing is original that you might think because it started somewhere. like a word we used many years ago. Show you right. It's still there. Uh, and, and many uh, entertainers have took a word that means one thing and take it to another level. I remember one that James Brown brought, put out and he knew because Papa didn't take no mess. When we mix messed up, he beats what out of us. But yet and still, he formulated it for him. That's what Madam C.J. Walker 
wanted us to do in the field of cosmetology. Take it to another level. <coughs> Excuse me. And that's what I, I'm trying to do. I, I learned what, everything I could out in the field. I did say field. A field of cosmetology. My travel. My looking. My understanding. My talking. And gathering information. Have helped me a long way. But then. What one might not know. Some think that Brother J.D. Hill taught me everything that I know. He did teach me a lot, but I taught him a lot of things he didn't know. But then, that's okay. We learn from somebody. I, I, I go back to the, the, the book of life, which is the Bible. It had to start from somewhere. The Creator. And sometimes we get caught up in that with the Creator. Everything that we do today was created at the beginning. You're going to find something at the beginning of Genesis, at the end of Revelation, somewhere in between. You're going to find something that can help you along the way when you're going through. My job is to help you while I'm still here. The song I play one day, I got to go home too. But at the meantime, while I'm here, I want to feed you everything I can to be the best you can be at you. My engineer, young engineer, always encourage him to be the best. One day, somebody's going to be watching you and they're going to be like you. But have more than one thing that you can do. Uh, I get caught up sometime in allergy and um, sinus bother me, but I don't let that stop me. In the office, at 40, 25 inch the road, I try to instill young men and women when they come in. Go to school. Learn everything you possibly can. To be the best that you can be. Because once you leave school, the book of knowledge, now you got to come out in the real world and put all that work, all that knowledge and stuff to work. And it's not going to work like you read it in that book. It's different. There's a book way and there's a world that way. And that's what you got to look. Now get the knowledge. This morning I was in the bed thinking as I, as I gave up, did my prayer, I was thinking. <laughs> Yesterday the pastor was speaking about love. That's what's wrong with the world today. It's not enough love left in the world. I'm not talking about that passionate love. I'm talking about the love of life, the love of others, the love of helping somebody else along the way. And want to see somebody else, somebody be successful. Somebody that can go, go walk in a different path that you walked in. Somebody going to take what you do and take it to another level. And then you can look back and say, mm, I remember. Then you can smile. I remember as I was talking about this, let me take a sip of tea for you, okay? This is for you, but it's for me too. Mm. I remember life is going back in my lifetime. There was a young man called Casanova, huh, and Don Juan. They were both been the players of the players, but one was up front, kind of on a harsh way. And one was smooth. Uh, you say, you can put him in any category you want to, but you say Don Juan walk up and say, hey, don't I know you from someplace? Didn't I see you down that, 
you know, you look like now Casanova might come by and say, Hello, young lady, how are you tonight? See the change in the voice is nice. You have to be nice if you want to get where you want to go. You have to treat everybody right. The book said treat everybody right. As I stated earlier from, the, from Genesis to Revelation, you heard the same thing but different. Our Creator made us all the same but different. We got hair but different textures. We got hair but different lengths. We got straight hair. We got curly hair. And, and I might say you got unhappy hair. And some have no hair, but it's okay. Learn to deal with it in the best way. That's why I mentioned the two uh, a guy, uh, Don Juan and Casanova. It doesn't matter how you say things, just long as you say it in a, 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 a loving and respectable way. When I was in beauty school, I threw a new hair texture. I was calling it nappy. When my instructor called my attention, you know, it's not nappy hair. It's called over excessively curly hair, which is good hair. Somebody else talking about good hair. They take straight hair with good hair. But over excessively curly hair is a better hair. It can sustain almost anything. Depending on the person who are taking care of it. But this is what I, I learned along the way, just sharing with you this morning a little thing. But uh, we are working hard to keep bringing you the best of the best. I stay in touch with the chemists all the time to, and to learn more and telling him what we have left in the vault while I'm still around and can you produce it. If you do, I want the best of the best. I don't want to alternate nothing from what my friend said. We want to continue with that down that path, even better and greater. That's why I looked at this and and, and talking about the, the 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 product of yesterday. Uh, for example, um, May Rain had coconut Joe. He had. All these great oils that were great for the hair back in the day. Somewhere along the line, they fell by the wayside. And these things I had told my friends, so we put wrote them down and put them up. But now they begin to flourish back again. All these great oils, the, the, the healing oils for the hair in the body. That was already out many years ago. Been put away, but they're coming back. Black seed oil, coconut oil, uh, carrot oil. You know, I'm, you, you name it, everything was good for our inner. It's also great for our outer. And that's what I want you to know about. Now, the, 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 we were talking about the wild growth oil. Uh, the wild growth oil, I'm going to bring this around here for you can see it with me. I'm going to bring it around where you can see it with me. The wild growth oil uh, up there. Okay, these are oils that we can, that, that, that's been around for a long time. But you want to see it a little different. So we're working on that. The wild growth oil treatments are already out there. But now they want a solid to help the hair grow even a little bit faster. So we're coming to a solid now with the shea butter, okay? Got the shea butter in it. It's got black seed oil on it in it. It's got coconut oil in it. Uh, 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 you name it, it's in there, okay? So I just wanted to let you know, with the knowledge and the understanding that my friend gave me, I'm bringing it to you. I'm bringing to you in, in, in much more in depth than I were before. Because I want you to have the understanding. Yes, it's common. But in the of 2000, give it to you with sense. It makes sense. But yet, I want you to, when you get told to this product, don't change the way you're using it from, from the Energizer 2000 fertilizer hair growth treatment. 
you use a little less, but you still want to do it at night just before you go to sleep. Or the scalp good, give it a good massage, and comb the rest of it through your hair. At the meantime, tell God thank you. I use a phrase, somebody look at me funny, I say I work for God, but Jesus is my boss. But when you thank him, then you spread the news, thank you God, for your son Jesus who died on the cross for you and I, so we can have a better health of hair and better health of body and better understanding of life. It all go together. It all go together. I'm going to get my engineer, if you will, to put on that commercial and then behind that commercial, uh, oh, just the intro of uh, this silk uh, product, how you can order it. And uh, uh, I'm going to tell you why he's preparing that. For, for any, any one of my famous distributors, you, 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 you can be able to call and you can order it by calling the hot number, error code 313-277-2319. I'm going to call a few names. I, I still got Brother Harvey. I have SOS. I have uh, uh, Come Home of Beauty. I have uh, Malik Shabazz. I have and, and Sister Okila. I still have Brother Billy Jones and his partner. And then I have one of the greatest brother uh, 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 Hall right around the corner from here. And many, many of us, you can call that at the station and uh, called up front, and the young lady up there, uh, she, uh, I, I'm bad with names, but called up front there at, at, at uh, uh, 885, what is that number, 885-4321, 885-4321, and she will take care of you up there. But then, Mr. Hall, and also Southwest Detroit, uh, you call me at area code 313-277-2319, and I'll give you all the rest of my distributors in around and about town okay because i won't want you to miss and the, as i said the um the, the coconut oil hair and scalp the vitamin e hair and scalp and the olive oil hair and scalp these are solid hair oils okay hair greases uh, let, me, let me make sure you understand it. these are items here are light hair grease solid oils is liquid they use the word oil because it's in there but the, the liquid is 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 a watery like but it's liquid but the solid is solid like you're going to open up a jar of peanut butter okay it's solid like that but it's very light penetrates real real easy it don't take much but i don't want you to oil your hair as much as i want you to take care of that scalp the growth is in the loosen of the muscles of the scalp so the product can go in and feed the hair products so you can have long, beautiful, healthy hair. And the oil is great for the skin, too. We have the product for the beard. You see a young man out there and, and cooking that barbecue and chicken and stuff like that. And you see all them, mm, mm, them ladies around because he's wearing that beard cream. And it is like a drawing card. I don't know have good food, but I smell good, too. Is that right, brother? So, but now... All of that works together. Thank you, Brother J.D. Thank you. I know you're going on. You're sitting up high looking down low. Thank you for putting me in to your inner circle of the hair care product line. Thank you for allowing me to work with you. Thank you for putting your mind into my mind and we work together to grow this company. And it's still growing. Call Evercode 313. 277-2319 for any of the great distributors in the metro Detroit area and I, they're all over the place and matter of fact I got another distributor getting ready to hit the Georgia scene and, and got ready you know better than, than, than you know what I'm trying to say but call this number ever call 313-277-2319 now go on the internet go on the internet at www.aecsilksilk.com, you pick it up and go forward slash store. Use the word comma. Comma Google. Google it up. And you're going to see more and more of this product. 
on the internet. Can you place an order on the internet? Yes. It's there. But ever call 313-277-2319. And this product is so good and very light. You want the product to make love to your hair. To give you that sheen, give you that softness, give you that million dollar look. Some say it, the silk does it. Silky smooth, body, oil, very light. And now, there's a coconut liquid oil also. There's a coconut hair and scalp condition which is solid. But it's a shea butter, coconut shea butter oil. Coconut shea butter oil. Make your body feel so good. Mm. If you didn't know it, you'd be wanting to make love to yourself. Okay. As we can, can I'm going to ask the engineer if you can put that. CD on and, and I won't worry about the commercial. Give me a little bit of that CD of number three and uh, so I can take a breather. Will you do that for me, sir? Uh, we continue to move on forward. This is George Trudy, the hair doctor right here at WHPR TV 33 Comcast on your dial. I think it's number 90. Put us up on the internet at www.whprtv33 and you'll see this smiling face and, and you can tell somebody else to check us out and tune in. Every first two, first and second Monday in the month, every first and second Monday in the month, uh, I'll be here. And if something happens, I'll be. I'll still will be here. Call me this number. Every call three one three two seven seven two three one nine. Every call three one three two seven seven two three one nine. I'm have a sip of tea just for you. It's mm, mm, mm. so good. So good as we are uh, continue moving on. You know the hot number. Give me a call right now. The lines is open. You want now. There are more items in the in the line than this. We have the granny soap, and we have the cream shine, deep penetrating conditioner, the KGMS package. Um, we have the hair tonic for the men, beard cream for the men, and coming soon. There are two other items. Since the guys are wearing beard, my, my chemist say he's going to do a beard oil and a beard cream. They should be coming in pretty soon. I'll be telling you more about that for the men. All right? And then since we talking about the ladies, that's why I brought up Madam C.J. Walker. She put it out there first. We can't forget our sisters who were standing up front and were doing a great thing in a lifetime, and they are on their way back. They never stop, but they're coming behind the curtain to up front. Matter of fact, on this station, you find different ones with different shows. They're stepping up. Men, you got to come along or you're going to be left alone. You got to step it up. That's including what I do. My daughter, Miss E, already stepping up. You got to step up. I'm hoping my baby girl is going to step up. But then, thank God for different mindsets, different way of thinking for each and every one of us. So we have our own idea and we have our own identity. We have our own uh, DNA. We have our own fingerprint that we can be whatever we want to be by putting God first. You can make it. Everybody can't be a teacher and everybody can't be a preacher. But we can help somebody along the way on what we say. We can turn them off or we can turn them on. On the word that we use and how you use word. I can speak a word that will turn you off. And I can speak a word that will make you feel good about yourself. That's what life is. It's not always trying to put somebody down. It's not always want to be a player hater. It's not always want to know everything and nobody else know nothing. But for what you think you know, somebody else knows just a little bit 
about it in a different, it might, be, it might be better, it might be worse, but it's a little different. We might be able to help you. How you know that? Well, when I got into cars, I thought I knew everything. But when I got into car school to learn the basics, I realized I didn't. One of my instructors called me to the side and said, sure, and you'll learn more. I did, and I began to learn more. I know it all, only know what he think he know. But God touched somebody else and showed him a better way. You don't believe that, huh? It happened. The stories I could tell. But one day I'll tell you some more stories about me. I'm going to give you a little bit. I tell everybody I don't know nothing about nothing, but I know a little about a lot. Automobile repair. I forgot more about automobile repair and than ever the average individual is trying to learn. Because I started at the bottom and worked all the way to the top. Electrical. Basic to master. Automobile, I did engine, complete overhaul. I did brake, complete overhaul. I did transmission, complete overhaul in my dime, in my time. Some of the mechanics were making big money. God showed me the way to make the same amount of money doing the same thing and more. But he took me to another path. He took me to hair and understanding the knowledge of hair. Same thing, but different. Same thing, but different. If he can take me, a country boy like me, and take me there, we can do with a city person like you. But you got to believe. And you got to understand. I was on the radio station. I became my own engineer. I DJed in a nightclub. I mean, some of everything this young man have done in his lifetime. Some I was proud of, some I was not proud of. But it was a learning experience. Everything God let me go through with and brought me out of was a learning experience for this day. Somebody come in with some problem, he showed me how to help them to solve their own problem. But put him first. Now have I lost some of it? Yes. But if I take my time and go back into the memory bank of my mind, it can be pulled up. But continue putting him first. Can you understand that? A friend of mine told me, we all got What's that word? I'm mean, make sure I get it together straight now. Reservation, but not cancellation. Somewhere on God's ground. We have nothing to do with coming here, and we have nothing to do when we can leave here. But what you have something to do with while you're here, and that's to help somebody along the way. And that's what it's all about with me. Call up you, um, I mean, my, my caller going to call in if it's time. To, it's open up for you now for, to call on in. And if you hearing me this morning, call on in and, and let it rip. Okay, we're going to let you rip to what you want to talk about. I'm waiting for you. So in the meantime, I'm having a sip of this tea. You know, tea is good for you. At least it is for me. You know, it it helps. Uh, neutralize uh, whatever's going on in, within your mind, help your mind to get smooth. My tea does. Let's go to the phone line. 
Hello, Carly on the air. Carla, you there? Are you there, Carla? Can you hear me? Hello, are you there? Can you hear me? Yeah, go ahead. Okay, um, can you hear me now? I can hear you. Go ahead. Okay, um, I wanted to um, express some concerns and see how you, what you think about it. You know the Charles Wright uh, Museum of African American History? Yes, sir. Um, it seems like they've gone under some kind of leadership or board of directors change because, uh, for instance, the, the African World Festival this past weekend, they didn't do any outreach. They didn't let the community know anything about it. I didn't hear any commercials or nothing. And when I went past there, all I saw, well, I saw a lot of corporate banners and roofs. It's like corporations have taken it over, and then they're trying to not call it Charles Wright Museum of African American History. They're trying to um, shorten the name to the Wright Museum. And uh, I think that's uh, not right. I think it's disrespectful to the founder of the place, um, Charles Wright, uh, to refer to that uh, institution as the Wright instead of the Charles Wright Museum of African American History. And um, I heard that they got, you know, a whole bunch of non-Africans on the board now. And um, by the looks of that festival over the weekend with all those corporate vendors, uh, it, it's just just not right. I, but I guess it's all in line with what's happening with Detroit and a lot of Detroit institutions. They torn down or they're about to tear down Joe Lewis Arena. You know what I'm saying? And um, anyway, uh, I'm not surprised, but I'm just uh, concerned and still outraged by it. What do you think about it? Thank you. Thank you for putting it out there. You you, you taught me something this morning I didn't know about. Thank you, Carla. Thank you so much. Right. Thank you. But, you know, um, I guess we got into the karma without the sense. Somewhere along the line, we were giving up everything. But then, I don't know, so I, I can't come in or elaborate on something I don't quite understand. And uh, Carla, thank you so much for putting that information out. I think somebody else might be thinking the same as you. But what is happening to us? We seem like we're not putting our best foot forward. We thinking somebody more now and ever before. We thinking somebody else's ice is much cooler than or colder than ours and it tastes better. But then, thank God for bringing us through this far. And it's so much that I would like to say that I don't understand. But we got to take back over of what we give away. We got to stop waiting around for somebody else to take, do for us that we can do for ourselves. Those one of the things my, my friend used to say all the time, uh, God make a way for you, but then what do we do? What do we do? There was somebody used to say, wake up Detroit. Look around and see what's going on. The leaders, our leaders of yesterday is gone. The new leaders of, to, of, of tomorrow is coming along, but where are they leading us? Down the pathway or the wrong way? Taken to the point of the hair care product, the hair care interest, it's going a different way. A trillion billion dollar business is going to somebody else. We are taking care of everybody but ourselves. God didn't put it that way. He wanted us to stand on our own. He gave us the, the know-how. If you go back, back in the day when they said one person could make the train, but he couldn't keep it from burning up, well, one of us did. Got the lights are burning, but he couldn't keep it lit, but someone of us did. 
It's so much that we got, we got much black history that we, we've forgotten all about. Now it's somebody else's history. But uh, my caller was supposed to call in and on, on, on tell us about uh, something about the body and the oils that we have. Uh, evidently, they uh, might have took some medicine and went to sleep. I don't know what happened, but uh, we're going to uh, leave the line open if you want to call in and tell us about that. But anybody else want to uh, add on? Don't forget that we do have the Grandi Soap. All of my distributors have it or have access to it. All the product that you hear about, call your uh, distributor and ask them about it and tell them to call me. I let them know when it's coming in, so if you're interested in it. And as soon as some of the product uh, they get here, uh, it will be here at the station. And, uh, oh, Sister Renee. I said, I have a problem with name, Sister Renee. As for her, and at 868-6612, uh, uh, as 868-6612, and she'll tell you more about what she has. Come in and see her. And I have other distributors in the Highland Park area. You can call area code 313 Two seven seven two three one nine for the nearest distributor near you, and uh, I promise when I come back in on the first weekend of September, uh, 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 I think it's September, but I will have the um, uh, more information, which I have all the distributor number with with me at the time. But I have other great news, but I can't elaborate on it right now. There's something getting ready to happen big, and uh, I can't tell you nothing about it till I get more information about it. And when, when, when I bring it to you, then you're going to say, he told me. But remember, the young man, I thank you for calling in this morning, call her. I think, uh, who did I put that song out a long time ago? I forget his name, but wake up. Everybody stop sleeping in bed. You know who I'm talking about. We got to get up. We got to get up. Uh, I heard somebody say, wake up, Detroit. I said, wake up, black folks. Wake up. Look in the mirror and ask me, what can I do to be better? Which way can I do to be better? What can I do to be better? Put God first and begin to pray that he'll help make it better for our future generation. Bring common sense back. Don't yet be common. Let them begin to think how to do things. How to be very creative. Don't let everybody else take away your, your mind. Use your mind for yourself. If you a doctor in the field of medicine, be the best. I believe the word, I don't know if I have it correctly, but I'm going to make it short. If you're going to be a great chef, be the best. If you're going to be a great caterer, be your best. Let your food that you do have some love in it. The love that when somebody eat it, they can't wait to get back for some more. We have to keep using that mind to improve on whatever we do. I try every day to do the same thing that I'm telling you. Dig back in the archives of your mind. The road you have traveled that you can bring forward and thoughts you had that you can bring forward to make it better, whatever it may be. Bring it out of you. Teach somebody or tell somebody. Because they can't do what you do. They might be a little bit better than you, but you have to go to work to improve what you're doing. But somebody will take it into another level. That's what we have to do with life. The next generation, the next generation, the next generation. Got to keep moving forward. We come a long way, but we got a long way to go. In many instances, we go backwards instead of going forward. But I want to see you go forward. Remember, first two Mondays in the month, yours truly will be here. And who knows what he's going to bring for you next time he come on. He's going to have something ready for you. Pray for me as I pray for you. 
praise the Lord, I'll be able to see you a long time. Continue to bring in you something that's important for you. And we're giving it to you. at no charge. My friend upstairs, give it to us at no charge. If we accept it. But if we go down the pathway the wrong way, you don't charge him for it. He didn't charge you. The other friend grabbed you. He hates to let you go, but he'll take you back in a second. But his job is to come in quick and steal, kill, and destroy. And my friend said, I come to have you have life and life more abundantly. All right? I just want to give that little bit to you. I thank you for listening. I thank you for, 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 for watching me as I watch you. And I hope that something that I talked about today will grab you and grow into you to help somebody else along the way. It's time for me to make ways and get out, out so somebody else can come in and take my place. But until next uh, two weeks from now, I believe it's two weeks from now, or the first Monday, shall I say, I, I will see you then if it's God's will and the creek don't rise. But if it's God's will and the creek rise, I'll see you then. Until then, my friend, may God continue to keep you and blessing you and hold on to you until we meet again. Until then, my friend, may God bless you and I keep and keep you. And goodbye to you. We have an array of products to assist you in all your beauty or body needs. Do you want curly, soft, beautiful hair? Well, try our relaxion line, designed to leave your hair soft, silky, and full of body. Or would you like beautiful, straight, shiny, long-lasting hair? Well, try our cherry or extreme hold spritz with our cream shine. It's guaranteed to give you that look you want. How about dry, achy feet or legs that you can't seem to keep moisturized? Well, try our African Shea Butter Foot Lotion. We have many products to help you with all phases of your beauty and body needs. For a full list of all our products, please visit our website at www.aeasysilk.com or call us at 313-277-2319. Has age finally caught up with you? Do you have high blood pressure, diabetes, or kidney disease? Well, look and feel younger today. We discovered a new product that promotes appearance and joint issues by the way of collagen, HA, and other super ingredients without injections. This product will significantly improve joint mobility, help with high blood pressure, kidney disease, and diabetes. It also help your skin as well. Call us now at 706-319-0255 or 313-885-4321.